Hi everyone, my name is Hannah Haley. I look forward to being in Social Work 302 with you all. Um, my pronouns are her, hers, and she. I have, sorry, this chair, I need to pick a spot to sit in. So, um, I have always attended the University of Louisville. I moved up there fall of 2017 and I took off work. I really just wanted to focus on being in school. I came in as a nursing major and then I moved into dental hygiene. But I always really felt like social work was something that I wanted to do. I was just, there's, it's just such a broad field and I wanted the security of knowing that I would be in something like dental hygiene where you just go and you be a dental hygienist. But I'm glad that I made the switch and I have the opportunity to go through the University of Louisville's Kent School. I, I really, I wouldn't want to be taking these courses anywhere else. And um, so now, right now, I don't live in the city of Louisville. I actually, I live back home in Owensboro, Kentucky. It's where I grew up. I went to high school here. I never thought I'd be back. Um, it's definitely it you know you go out and you see it everyone that you knew at one time and I, I definitely I miss being in the bigger city of Louisville but um Owensboro is definitely rural it's a lot of farmland around small town um so moving on I um really am interested in social work. I would like to, I don't really know where I want my career to take me. I know that I'm interested in working with children. I'm interested in working with survivors of maybe domestic violence or assault. And then I think maybe working in a prison would be neat. I think working with survivors of human trafficking or I had the opportunity to work on campus for a while. It was I was working at Laundry Tan Connection and I worked with some women from the Hilling Place and they were um, in recovery. They were recovering addicts and I really enjoyed being able to work with them and hearing their stories that they shared with me and I would like to have the proper education to help them if they one day came to me for help. Um, after my bachelor's that I obtained from the University of Louisville, I plan to move into the master's program. I think that I would probably do that immediately, just because I know that there's more job opportunities after that, and what I want to do, I want to be able to have the highest education. I don't really want to get a doctorate, but I would like to get my master's to have better job opportunities and really do what I would like to do within social work, even though I don't know really what area I will go into. A lot of different things have my interest and I know that I'm gonna need to decide before I get my master's, but I'm just, I'm not there yet. So right now I am a server at Olive Garden here in Owensboro. I've taken some time off just to really be able to focus on starting school since online is new to me. I wanted to be able to really be able to give it my all and not have to worry about the different schedule each week with serving. Serving each week, they really throw a different schedule out at you. And I wasn't sure about the times of the classes and just wanted to be able to give it my entire focus. Sorry, I think I have a cold right now, but um, during the pandemic, I have thankfully I've been home. It really, it started to pick up here whenever I had my 21st birthday, which was March 20th. That's whenever the restaurant started to close. Like, um, I remember I couldn't go and go to a restaurant for my 21st birthday. So I think that's whenever I was laid off of work, everything shut down. And um, I was glad to be back home with family. I live with my grandparents. So it was comforting to know that I wasn't gonna be struggling to make rent or you know, a lot of people really were struggling during that time to make ends meet, so thankfully I was here in town. Um, I, my immediate family has been okay through the pandemic. They haven't 
caught corona, but I know that some of my family in Evansville has recently um, contracted corona. I think they're doing fine. They're going to be all right, but it's a scary time. It's unknown um, what can really happen. I really am sorry about the chair. So my little sister, she's 11 and she was supposed to start middle school this fall and she's not going to be able to go and do that since the governor here in Kentucky recommended that schools stay shut down for a little bit longer. So some challenges that I face as a college student now being online would be probably navigating technology. I've never been the most tech savvy person need to get better about it but it's a learning experience um i being at home is also difficult but it's nice in other aspects like i this is my maybe third time recording this video because my little sibling she's over here and she did a run through earlier <laughs> and i didn't want to leave that in here so um and i i will probably miss just being able to live in the city of Louisville but it's fine, I'm home and it's gonna be great. We're gonna have a great semester. And another thing that I'll add, I have three dogs that are staying at my mom's house. They are two miniature schnauzers. One's Bella and the younger miniature schnauzer is Baxter. And then my mom got a pug about two years ago. So he's about two now and his name is Pudge. He's a chunky little boy but um, love him and then my grandma is going to be getting a miniature schnauzer here in a couple weeks it's gonna be a puppy but it'll grow to be stand taller than me probably but I really hope that this YouTube video was okay and I look forward to getting to know each of you and seeing your videos and I hope that you all have a great semester